morning, guys. Right now we're inside one of the okay. treatment areas here at Elite, and we're getting a lesson for people who have problems with their ankles. Uh, first of all, I want to reintroduce you again to Leah DeLott. Now, Leah, why would people have stiffness in their ankles? What could cause that? I mean, there's so many reasons. Maybe they sprain their ankle. Maybe it's a past ankle sprain. What tends to happen is that ankle just gets stiff afterwards, and if it's not treated, it can lead to other things. Um, a big reason also could be they're working in really stiff boots get stiff that way. Um, weakness through that core area, which needs to be stable. If that's not stable, because the foot's the first point with the ground, it's gonna try to get stiff to almost give it some of that support. Gotcha, now you're doing a pretty interesting exercise. When you think tables, you think someone lying down and relaxing, but we got uh, we got Ricky kneeling on here and you're belted into him. What is this particular uh, thing so that you're doing? Anytime we use a belt like this and they're moving, it's called a mulligan technique. So it's a mobilization with movement. So he's going into a position that might feel blocked and I'm helping him get there by putting a bit extra weight through that joint area. Wow, really interesting stuff that we certainly would not think to do on our own or know to do on our own. What other sorts of things do you guys do in this treatment area? Well, this is lots of times where the assessment will actually take place. So we can do lots of the standing things, but we can get them on a bed, see joint range of motion, and then treatment wise, it's gonna involve some joint mobilizations, maybe some manipulations. Um, it, we, could, we do acupuncture, some wow. massage, lots of soft tissue work. A whole variety of things to mm -hmm. help uh, get me back in shape. Yeah. And you know what? Actually, a lot of education where we teach the client maybe what their injury is about, why it happened, and what they can do education-wise to help themselves. All right, Leah, thanks so much. <laughs> My pleasure. Uh, we're going to continue learning a little bit about what you can be doing for prehabilitation to take care of yourself before an injury happens, but right now, I'll send it back to the BT studio.